the UNBC Timberwolves hosting the University of Fraser Valley Cascades, the T-Wolves home opener up in Prince George, and we picked this one up early in the first half, just 2 minutes and 23 seconds in to be exact. Harmon Minhas will take a pass from Bradley Weir and beat UNBC keeper Rob Goody just inside the near post, the 500 people in attendance quieted, and it's 1-0 Cascades. Just 13 minutes later, another opportunity for UFV. This time it's Weir on the attack. His shot partially blocked here by freshman defender Damian Drawn, but it pops up and over a charging Rob Goody. The fourth year keeper though, he recovers nicely, getting back to retrieve it as you see from this angle. A dangerous opportunity, but to no avail. The T-Wolves actually controlled play from there, out shooting and out chancing the visitors, including this opportunity on a free kick, Kensho Ando. He's going to play a great ball into traffic in the box, Anthony Preston gets a piece of it, but not quite enough. The Prince George product cannot believe it, as he's oh so close to making good there. Great chances by Michael Henman and Owen Stewart, also thwarted by UFV's Ethan Duggan, so we move to the second half. 54th minute now, the Timberwolves continuing to pressure, it's Hussein Beharry, he'll tap it to Kensho Ando who picks a corner and fires but again Duggan up to the challenge he makes a diving stop flying to his right side two new Timberwolves the Harry and Ando ever so close to connecting on a massive play there but UNBC still seeking the equalizer in the 75th minute, the T-Wolves get what they're looking for here. Freshman Reed Adams, he's able to work it into the box, getting it over to Abu Sise. And look at this, the fake gets two defenders to bite, and then he makes absolutely no mistake going top corner on Duggan. Check it out from another angle as the native of Bamako, Mali, he scores his first of the campaign, and it's a big one, nodding this game at one goal apiece. Both teams coming close late in the game, but in the 81st minute, UFV is going to get a great opportunity. Trevor Zanata, he's taken down just outside the box, so a free kick awarded to the Cascades. It's Rajan Baines, the second year. He puts it right where he wants it, past an outstretched goody, but he catches nothing but the right post. Here's another peek at that opportunity as it stays out off the iron, and Baines, he just can't believe it. But that's how it finished as the final whistle goes. UNBC actually outshooting UFV 19-10, including a 13-6 margin on net. But this one ends in a 1-1 draw, Friday, August 30th in Prince George, BC. I think yeah, we played really good. But we, uh, we played as the coach told us. You know, we have to be aggressive, we have to be ruthless at the net. Uh, we made a couple of changes in the first half. That was sad, but it was good that we came back and then, you know, trying to win the game. Fortunately, it was 1-1. We get one point, they get one point. We come back for Sunday, even stronger. Definitely nerves, definitely nerve, you know. Uh, first home opener, you know, playing uh, in front of your home crowd, you know, it's kind of nervous, you're nervous, you know, it's kind of hard. Uh, <laughs> stuff, stuff, you know, but we keep, uh, we keep, we keep cool as we can, you know. And uh, hopefully Sunday we can, we can make the best of it. It was a tough game. Uh, defense, we were slow off the very start. So we, I got put under pressure with a bunch of shots to start. And then throughout the whole game, just they were coming at us the entire game. I don't think many of us really expected the high press where we would have to play long every goal kick and just try and play direct into our striker's feet. It definitely feels good to be coming in as a rookie and just making those saves just to try and keep our team in it. We probably have to press them right off the bat and try and win the ball up high just so we don't, we're avoiding their, their strikers and then just try and play through and finish our chances better.